All right, I'm gonna try a cute little sloth. You know about sloths, they hang upside down in a tree. They very seldom come down. So, um, again, we're gonna separate into four equal quadrants, just so you know where I'm talking about placement. And some of these projects can be done this way. I'm going to keep it this way just because I want to stay within your the, the uh, camera frame. Okay, so and we're going to be doing some erasing here. Um, and I need to erase a lot of his body. I'm going to start out with a pencil today on this guy. And then I'll go back over it once I do my finish line. So right here, right on this quadrant line, I'm going to start out with an oval. This is obviously his head. And then I'm going to draw his body upside down. And it's going to be right on this quadrant line. Maybe up a little bit. Back and around. Several. Can you see that? Okay. And then we're going to draw the uh, branch that he's holding on to. You know what? Let's wait. Let's draw his arms first. Because if you put the branch too high up, his arms are going to look really long. So let's make sure his arms look realistic first. So right about here... I'm just going to draw kind of like a band-aid shape and then back here I'm going to draw the same thing. All right, so is that, if that, as long as this looks realistic and he's not way up here, you can stop and then put the branch in. So the branch is going to go right here. And I'd be erasing here. So let me go over this now with the Sharpie so you can see it. Good. All right, now we need to put the other arms in. So we're going to shadow the uh, outside arms. I'm just going to draw a line here and draw a line here. So these are the arms that are on the other side of the sloth. And he has his long claws. And they're wrapped around. So this arm is wrapping around, but this arm is on the other side. So you can't see the claws for the outside arms. Okay. All right. He looks pretty good. And again, we're going to put some branches here and some leaves. And some branches over here. Okay, we'll load it up with some leaves. Let's do his face now. So inside this circle, I'm going to draw another circle. He has kind of like a little mask here. So I'm going to draw a line here and a line here. Just an oval. And then I'll put his little eyes in here. And let's give him a round nose. He's a happy guy. And I'm going to fur that up a little bit. And up here I'm going to also just give him some fur. So now when you color him, these will be brown and you'll keep his face white. Okay. So that's a cute little sloth hanging in the tree.